All right, another day of freaking uploading, making some videos, some streams. We just recently hit 2.7, almost 2.8. And uh, actually, let's just check our uh, let's check our live subscriber count. Let's see how we're doing. What the fuck, dude? What the fuck? Hey guys, huge Rick here, and yes, apparently we fucking lost like two, like 150 plus subs or some shit like that. It's it's fucking stupid. I don't even know why we even lost that many subs. Um, apparently, I wasn't the only one being affected. There was so many other YouTubers being affected by this. Apparently, at around 3 a.m. at, uh, I don't know, like two days ago or a day ago, 3 a.m., uh, I was in a call with uh, my friend Chaos, and then I was just chilling with my other friends. All I see, I just checked my live sub count, and out of nowhere, I just see that we fucking lost like 100 plus subs. And I was just like, what the fuck? Like, YouTube, what are you doing? Uh, at first I was just like, yo, is everyone like bashing on me or everyone just hate? Like, what did I do? Like, was it my latest video that everybody hated me for? But no, it wasn't for that. It was something else. Apparently YouTube was hacked, uh, I guess, or I don't even know. Honestly, YouTube, j uh, put on their, on their Twitter saying that they don't even know what's going on in their situation. Uh, they're just trying to figure out what's really going on, but... People are uh, speculating that Lizard Squad and Poodle, I don't know what the other uh, Poodle something, it was just those two hacking groups were uh, talking about tweeting some shit out about like they were going to plan something or they were just saying me and, and Poodle Squad or whatever, they were going to plan together and well they're teaming up together and uh, and they put hashtag like summer, uh, summer 2016 and I was just like oh what a coincidence. That they said they tweeted something out two hours before uh, the actual thing happened and YouTube like on their bio it said lol watch this and I was just like oh, this is a little strange here like this is not supposed to you know I don't I doubt that YouTube did it on purpose uh, I mean they tweeted out earlier saying like they don't even know what's going on so I'm guessing not they did get hacked and they they're just not saying it or they haven't got access to their account yet but uh, hopefully it's just a bug I think a lot of people saying that it's inactive subs uh, I don't know yet if it is inactive subs. I guess in a way that is good uh, For me at the time dude. I was so shocked. I was just like bro Like I was working so hard in uh, Monday stream We gained like a hundred plus subs in that one stream and I basically lost all of it. so I, I streamed for nothing <laughs> But I don't really care to be honest. I know I could gain them back um, Hopefully I could already imagine that we're gonna grow that back. You guys are strong. You guys are awesome Kuda squad has been growing so much quicker now uh, I'm not too butthurt. I know a lot of people have uh, have lost way more than me like PewDiePie apparently he lost like 600,000 bro, and I'm just like The fuck like dude, that's like that's more than half a million. I'm like holy shit, dude. That's crazy. I don't know. I, I would be pretty tight honestly, but uh, You know PewDiePie is big. Uh, I know some other youtubers like you know five period hybrid He hit 9k like a long time ago. He's like 9k point. Uh, I think it was 9.3 K and he got Dropped all like he dropped 400 subs and he was like all the way to 8.9 I think he just hit 9.9 K uh, again But it's just the fact that like people that hit milestones recently It, it just really sucks because now they're back down to uh, you know b below their milestone and also uh, people I actually did a stream before you know before the uh, Incident happened also people are saying that this was the it was called the YouTube purge and uh, I, I tweeted out saying you know anyone losing subs as well and people were tweeting out yes and everything like that and I was just like dude YouTube purge I don't know who created it, but I started going with it. I was like dude. This is this is fucking crazy Like everyone's losing subs. It's the YouTube purge man. It's going crazy and also like I was saying before uh, I actually did a stream on Monday the day before the you know the incident and basically uh, I did shout outs on Monday because I felt like because on Saturday Sunday I, I didn't have a good like stream even though my Saturday was a, my birthday and everything like that I just I ended it bad. So I basically wanted to stream again uh, on Monday It was like a little exception and we had a lot of viewers on that day for some random reason We had a lot of viewers just jumping on the stream and stuff like that. I was just like, oh, that's sick, dude That's crazy uh, and That's where we earned a lot of subs But the thing is that was like a sub Monday and basically if you guys don't know Saturday I do my sub Saturday and we do shout outs and we chill on the stream and instead I did it on Monday and I gave a lot of shout outs to a lot of people and a lot of them that I did shout out they hit milestones I made them hit milestones like let's say like some of them were like for an example uh, some people that had 70 subs I got them to, uh, to 100 and 
the sad thing is that now because of that YouTube purge, they dropped back to whatever they um, they were before or they even lost even more. So it kind of sucks, man. Like I tried to help out people and then now that the YouTube purge happened, it made me, it kind of made me feel bad. So the YouTube purge, it didn't really affect me as much. Like I don't really care, but it did affect a lot of people that I was just like, damn, bro, that sucks. Like it really does suck. Hopefully it was just a bug, but if it's not a bug, man, uh, you know, it's fine for me. You know, we can always grow back. It makes us YouTubers actually, you know, start uploading a lot more and start being productive again um you know if it is inactive subs you know i'll be i guess i'm all right just because nobody wants inactive subs so f it man i'm uh, back on the grind i was at 2.7 uh almost 2.8 on stream and now we're back to 2.6 which i'm fine to be honest i don't really care like i said i will grow that back uh hopefully on stream or like because a lot of you guys come on my stream man and it's awesome man because you guys really do enjoy the stream especially sub saturday because we chill and it's awesome man it's awesome on the other note uh some call of duty news yeah i actually didn't get to inform or make a video on this but apparently the third dlc uh was just announced that it's coming out july 12th on playstation you guys are known and a month later on xbox and it's been a while because i actually forgot that uh dlc was going on for black ops i felt like it was ending so quickly but we're on the third dlc uh i heard that the last one is going to be like in september instead of august just because of the map scheduling or whatever i don't even know but whatever at least we're gonna get the new map pack and apparently this new map pack it looks kind of pretty dope like i like the new zombies in it uh let me see let me actually see what's uh what the maps are so basically we have the map empire Psycho uh psychogen berserk and rumble and i'm putting some screenshots on right now on those maps if you guys want to like look them up i'm really not going to be talking about uh all these maps or whatever but the the new maps that are coming out the four new maps as well as the zombies is being called uh gorod gorod karavi something like that i don't know if i said that right but um it looks like it's in a city or something like that and like around like the 1940s or some shit like that i have no idea but uh it looks dope like i saw the trailer and it actually looks pretty cool so i don't know i'm interested in that i didn't really like the third zombies map to be honest, the sets of Bunushima, I don't even know if I said that right. Like, some of these zombies maps are getting a little, like, hard to say now. <laughs> I don't know who comes up with the names, but man, Jesus, these names sometimes get hard. Uh, but, anyways, this new one really looks interesting, and I actually want to try it. Besides that, actually, if you guys haven't noticed that, I actually got a haircut. I, you guys probably noticed from the beginning of the video. Yeah, I did get a haircut. Whatever you guys think about it, I don't, I don't know. I don't care. Uh, some of you guys think, like, it's cool. I've been waiting for a haircut for a very long time. Me and my friend were like, yo, I need a haircut. My barber, uh, the reasons I haven't gotten a haircut earlier is because I had to blame you guys for once. Uh, it was because my stream, because I kept over streaming and I scheduled my uh, appointment for haircuts for a long time. And I just kept missing the schedule, uh, kept missing my appointments. So, finally, I got my haircut yesterday. So, it's, it's pretty dope. It's pretty dope. Finally, I feel good. I, I love getting it. Like, I love the feeling of getting a new haircut. Like, it just makes you feel great. Because, you don't. I hate, like, hair just constantly you have to constantly be touching now that it's short and nice and it's ready for the summer man i don't know if you guys were wondering or whatever if you guys just were wondering like hey uh did he get a haircut yeah i did get a haircut so yeah anyways there, there you go i did get one dude I, I love playing call of duty now man so basically guys i gotta wrap up the video here uh i hope you guys did enjoy the video please smash a like button uh, so that's pretty much it uh a lot of people have been losing subs i'm not the only one tell me down in the comments below who uh how many subs have you lost and if you lost subs in general as well as some call of duty news and you know i did get a haircut finally so yeah <laughs> anyways i hope you guys enjoyed the video please smash a like button like always guys have a nice day and peace out <laughs>